thanks again for joining me for one of my adventures. Today, I'm going to head up to the Falls Road. Um, stay with me and we'll see what kind of digs I've got. Um, I'm going to be staying in a guest house in the Gale Talk area in the Falls Road, just off the Falls Road. So today what I did is I started with the bus. It's about 7.23 in the morning, took the bus to Dublin, so it's about 10 o'clock now. Now I'm making my way towards Conway Station, which is the train station that brings us up towards Belfast. It uh, shouldn't be a far walk from here. I'm just going to walk up. Now the, the plan is for the, uh, the next day, for Paddy's Day, is to enjoy Paddy's Day up in Belfast and uh, see what happens around the Falls Road on Paddy's Day. Now, um, despite we're going to show you, see what my things looks like in the accommodation. It cost me 24 pounds, which is very reasonable. And uh, now I'm heading towards the train, which cost me 13.99 euros, which is very reasonable as well. Um, and that will take me right into Belfast, and then we'll try to find a, uh, the bus to make our way towards uh, the Falls Road. Um, right now, I'm going to go get my ticket. I've pre-ordered pre it, so I just have to go to one of the kiosks, enter in the, uh, the, the code that they gave me to print up the ticket. And then uh, we're going to look for something to get a bite to eat, a restaurant break, and that. I think they have some services on the... Um, I think they have some services available on the train. We'll see what that's like. Um, I've got my seat booked, whether that comes to fruition somebody said that it doesn't always um, mean that just because you have the seat number but we'll see and uh, see what kind of uh, interesting uh, people we meet and uh, events that happen so right now I'm just gonna make my way towards the station it's just by the bus station here and just up ahead so it shouldn't be too far Bye. station and here's my ticket. So now I just have to find the machine, the kiosk. So, is it up or down? Let's take a look. Um, here's what it looks like around Dublin, the busiest part. Ooh, I wonder if we go up here. Okay, so we have to find the uh, inside Conway Station bag. How do you get in there? Is it the stairs or... Well, this looks like it should be it. We go... Conway Station. Here we go. That's what the sign says. Anyways. Now we'll just try to find where we can get our tickets. So far, so good. Okay. the maps. We're going up to Belfast, so I'd say it's the blue line, whatever that is. Okay. And it looks like we're going we're going up, James. Now we have to find the ticket machine. There's tickets. You're going at the station here. The train doesn't come in all the time. Right. See that big building in front of you? Yeah. That's the bus station. Oh, sorry. sorry. All right. Tickets. Uh, Tickets are now printing. Yeah, so you've already picked them up. Four. Yeah, those are your seats. Okay. 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 Yeah, what do you do? Mm -hmm. Show the pass. Alrighty. Thank you. Thank you. That's it. It's 13.99. To Belfast, 11.20. Very good. 
Now we're gonna try to find something to eat and then find out where we're going. So we're going to Belfast. Um, Departure is Belfast 1120, track two, right. Okay. Okay, right, so this is what it likes in Conway Station. There's a pharmacy, a convenience store, coffee place, a little bar. There's where the, uh, the trains are. And uh, we just popped into the corner there, there's the bathroom. And then I believe Mutt's my train there on tra platform two. And it weighs at 11.20 and it's 10.28. So we have a little while, so I'm gonna try to find something to eat and then we'll get sorted from there. Okay, so they have a coffee shop, uh, O'Brien's in the, uh, and this is what you get. So you give you a little sweet, some crisps. Uh, it's a breakfast bagel and a soya latte and it came to 10 euros, which is about $10.60 US. So I'm just going to have this and then we'll go try to find our way towards the platform. Okay, so now they've corralled us into this waiting area, if you can see around here. Uh, we're just waiting for them to call us in for a train. The train is just sitting on the track. I think it's basically just people getting employees and staff that are getting on there and ready. So it shouldn't be too much longer and we'll be on our way uh, heading up to the north. Looks pretty nice so far. Oh, they have the names on it and everything. Very handy. Oops, sorry. <laughs> okay, so going to do 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 do. Fifty nine. Here we are. Window. I think it's a window seat. in place now we're gonna try to find our way to get on the uh, G1 slider train try to get out of here now try to see it. Here we are. 
stuff too. Okay, so I jumped onto the G1 slider, but apparently that was going eastbound. So now we got off at Short Strand. So I have to cross over and then take the other side. So I just took one stop. I asked, uh, I asked somebody on the bus, because I wasn't sure. I just got off the, uh, the train, saw a bus coming that said G1. So I just chanced my arm. I had a 50-50 chance and not successful, but it's not the end of the world. Um, supposedly my ticket is good for the uh, the G1 sliders anyways from the the train so we come up to this light cross over and then we'll wait for the next bus now it's not a harm because uh, apparently it uh, stops every uh, six minutes one goes by so and then there you see the stop right over there there's a Here's what it looks like around me. And then I'll turn it off now till I get off, get onto the uh, bus stop on the other side. So I'm on the right bus now. <laughs> and it's handy out, it has a little sign up on the top where it tells you where you're going and to get off at which stop. So truth is, make sure you check the direction you're going first. Okay, so we got off the bus at the right stop. So I'm at, uh, Kennedy Park, Kennedy Center. So now there's the Felons Club. I have to try to find Glen Road. So there's Glen Drive, so Glen Parade. So it says cross the road. So we're going to cross the road. to Glen Parade. Uh, where is that? Glen, well, um, I have to do Glen Road. Hmm. Excuse me. Do you know where Glen uh, Parade is? Where? Glen Parade. Just continue on. That very first one I jumped too far. Thank you. So we're heading in the right direction. So there's... So it's a little bit more open than the last time I was here. Everything's uh, up and running. So we're going to do... Go up to find the guest house, get rid of this bag, freshen up a bit, and then head back out. I'm gonna walk around the falls and maybe take the, uh, we'll go to the center, get some money at an ATM, and then we'll uh, look at uh, getting out to the um, city center, see this show that's supposed to happen tonight. So we'll get something to eat and everything else. So we'll walk around and see what entails try to find out some information too like is there a parade here tomorrow at what time or do i have to go to the one in the city center so stay around and if you're new here like if you're watching this i know my belfast the falls road ones get a lot of views just uh don't be afraid to subscribe uh, my channel's growing decent enough but i'd like to get up to a thousand so hopefully so we're gonna go up uh glenn prayed we walk up Turn left into Glen Road. It's all Glen. Crescent, Glen. Everything's Glen, so. Glen Road to Grena. Grenche Shops. Okay. So I think this will be Glen Road here. We turn left. Yeah, here's Glen Road Surgery, so we're on the right track, see? Here's the 
approximately three minutes walk up Glen Road to Grandsha Shops on your right. Okay. Uh, turn left, I'm going to so left here. There's the hills in the background. St. Matthias's Church. So now what we're looking for is a shop. We turn, it's on my right, which is Grancha Avenue, straight up from the shops with a chemist. At the corner, we're looking for number 17. I see the chemist. So, let's cross over. Chinese food. Bad boy's Mexican. Doesn't look open yet. Hot food to bar, deliveries grill, wine fair, spirits. Pizza, maybe they're open later. Dental and the chemist. Okay, we must be getting close. So, I think we go up here. Number 17, near top on the right. The sign is at the gate. So, I think we're in the right track. As my granny used to say, cooking with gasoline. So, up near the top on the right. And we should be able to be there. Hensha Avenue. But right now it's traveling since seven o'clock this morning. It's a little bit after two now. We're almost at our destination for the first part. Stay with me, see what else happens. I'm gonna show you the room tour. Once we get sorted in there, and then get quick changed, just wash a bit, and then head back down and see what kind of mischief we can get up into. Get some money too, and some food. We're almost there. That'd probably be a better option. <laughs> I know. I prefer the adventure, as Dale Phillips says. Two strong legs. Why not? Well, here's 17 there. I'd say this is it. Almost walked by it. Okay, time for the room tour for 24 pounds in West Belfast in the Gale Talk area. So, you come in, there's a TV, a little stand with some coffee or tea that you make, a trickle water, and two single beds, the heater's on, it's actually quite warm in here, and then there's this little open garden area. So it's all very neat and tidy, and then I have the sole use of a, the bathroom, it's just at the end of the kitchen in there, so this is where I'll be staying tonight, but more importantly, now we're going to head towards the city center and see what the crack is.